So, hi, we are back with a new video. Let's get that out of the way. New video of Nicolo trying to make plasma printer. And uh, today we'll do a very simple thing that is, if you look at corners, they are okay ish when using the breeze light theme, but when you switch to dark, you get this very ugly effect of uh, having this uh, light pixels at the very border. It looks bad. So let's try to fix it in the most simple way possible. And that is, uh, well, I should give you a bit of background on why this bug is happening in the first place. So how this works is you have a um, pop-up, which could be the applet, the plasmoid, blah, blah, blah. Behind it, you have all the effects. Just like uh, as an example, there's blur, which we do. And then there's one that's called contrast effect. So what contrast effect does, it is it takes color from the background and then it pumps them up to be uh, more visible. So if you got like, or as I have right now, a green uh, wallpaper, well now it's blue, a blue wallpaper, it will take that blue and make it even bluer. It pumps up saturation contrast values so that the blur effect can be nicer even at very low transparencies. Like uh, plasma theme right now, it's actually very transparent if you look uh, using it on some wallpapers, but it's actually just 10% transparent, which compared to any theme is very little. And that is because we actually take the color, pump the saturation up and then apply blur. But what happens is the, the effect also makes the wallpaper a bit lighter. And in the corners, there's this problem that you have um, the natural corner, corner of the applet, and then you give a mask uh, to the contrast effect so that it's also applied in the corner. And this works. But whereas the corner of the applet is anti-aliased, the one of the contrast effects seem to be not so, meaning that you have a couple of pixels in the corner that have the contrast effect, even though they are not below the applet. And those pixels, they have saturation lightness pumped up, and so they look white. Not very visible on this wallpaper, so let's switch to the next one, like this. I guess, uh, now, the simplest simplest way to fix this, probably this shouldn't be called a fix, but is to uh, make the mask a bit smaller compared to the actual applet, which could have some issues, so we need to make sure that it doesn't. So first of all, um, let's check which branch we're in. So let's get back to master. Get pull. Uh, let's go into translucent. Let's start with the dialog background. So this one. And again, we'll do the simple, simplest thing possible. And that is to take the mask, which is this black thing and make it a bit smaller. Easy. So let's see right now it's like this. So like this, like this, a bit smaller. Maybe it's not enough. We'll do, we'll make it even smaller. That's uh, my idea at least. What uh, a developer suggested was to actually add a opaque one pixel outline all around the applet, which hides this effect. But I mean, we can do better and we don't plan to do any outline, but maybe we'll do, I don't know. Let's also make red into the applet so that we know we are using the correct SVG. As I've said also in the last video, which is like 10 minutes ago for me. Okay, it is red, so that is working. And the corners still have the bug, so we should make it even smaller. Okay, so bye bye red and you choose 
let's go with very small and see if there's any issue with that let's actually okay let, let's try this one first on the top corners like just on the top corners for now and see if it works uh, well now the effect is much less visible maybe it's the wallpaper let's try to switch to the next one okay looks good looks good looks good I mean if it works I think I'll just go with this it's uglyish but I prefer it working <laughs> when you open up the start menu maybe I shouldn't tell you this because maybe you hadn't noticed but when you open the start menu and then close it you can see that there's this white line at the top that appears when it's moving and it's very likely like I'm pretty sure that that white line is also when the applet is actually drawn one pixel below the uh, mask of the contrast effect so we got we get one line of contrast effect so now comes the lazy part sorry the boring part lazy that is me and it's to actually do this operation on every single mask that we have and we have a lot of them so let's start to be honest the more i tweak with the uh, kadi's uh, svg theming the more i don't like um, the idea of using SVGs they're a bit too unreliable in the future like I were starting to talk about possibly doing a new theming system hopefully I mean not hopefully probably without breaking uh, existing themes so that people are happy but yeah starting to say hey you can switch to the, the new theming system we, we're talking years from now so no, nothing to worry about it's just an idea for now but yeah we also have mm, little to no idea of our uh, new theming system could be like we have got a couple of proposals but nothing nothing that we can act on already I'll also say, since I don't have anything better to do, the floating panels, that's still something uh, on my to-do list. The issue with those right now is that they need client-side shadows, which is tough, like really tough. So just making the panel float is easy, drawing the shadow not easy at all. Uh, I had half a idea of telling themes that they can have floating panels but without shadows, like at all. Which is a bit of a pity. But actually implementing CSD shadows for uh, 
good at background actually implementing CSD shadows for the panel seems like something that would or maybe will take a lot of time so I need to look into that right now I'm focusing on making plasma just looks look good okay no issue because the last update 5.22 brought in a bit of bugs so I want to start fixing bugs like there's no tomorrow okay so that was it I think we've done everything so let's commit make mask smaller on corners to prevent uh, broken pixels git push war, um, origin work Nikolov what's the name again fix light corners and let's make a request for this one as well so let's uh, include a screenshot of that so oh I don't know if it will be accepted like this because it's not the prettiest solution but it is a solution so maybe it will anyway one way or another we will fix this bug so bye if you want me to continue doing this kind of stuff uh where's this kind of stuff feel free to subscribe blah 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 and i've also got some links that should like swipe in uh, slide in sorry right now from the left side of the screen with the donations thank you for those donating and if you want to make me go forward in my free time donating is a good way of <laughs> giving me motivation to do this so bye for now